Dr. Sutton, we have some non-getting hit by a car questions from our viewers <laughs> that we're going to head to now. Here's the first one. Could nasal irrigation decrease your risk of contracting COVID-19? You know, this is something that at first I thought was just a, just an old tale, maybe. But then I actually went and looked up. There was actually research that has been done, not on the Omicron variant, but on prior variants that shows that it might be helpful for patients, especially those who are feeling symptoms in terms of sinusitis. Uh, nasal flushing is something that we've utilized in medicine for a long time, especially for patients who suffer from allergies. And I think that it's OK if you want to try it and make sure and see if it helps your symptoms. That's completely fine. I would just make sure you're using clean irrigation products, making sure that you're using sterile water or water that has been previously boiled uh, because there is a risk of infection and obviously not overdoing it. Okay, and again, most everybody in the studio here, and looking at Alicia as well, the neti pot. Uh, we don't yeah. usually hear it as nasal irrigation, if that's the <laughs> medical term for it, but uh, we get it. All right, Dr. Sutton, thank you thank as you. always. Thank you for translating, TJ. Okay, no worries. No worries. <laughs> All right, keep your questions coming to Dr. Sutton on his Instagram. You can send them to Dr. Darian. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.